Hi, you guys. Good morning, brothers and sisters and friends. Um, I just wanted to come on here, and as I was in prayer this morning, I was asking the Lord to, to, to bring me a word, you know, show me a message, um, and I'll share it with others. And I opened up the Bible, and it just fell on Esther and I felt the Holy Spirit over me like oh just pressing on me and so it was just yes 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 so much like excitement joy and love I feel so I and then I, I got another he gave me another scripture too so he answered um, my prayer and so with that I told him that I would be obedient and share it so that's what I'm doing so if you are having a hard day or a hard week our, he is coming and he led me to <laughs> the Bible opened up on Esther 2 where Esther becomes the queen and so, I mean, I just felt his presence all over me during I read this chapter, especially um, when Esther was taken to the king, Exorix, at the royal palace in the early winter, which um, in Hebrew, it is the, the tenth month of the seventh year of his reign. And you guys... In Hebrew, we have we are in that tenth month. I don't know how much information that people or how much knowledge people have with this type of thing, um, but I was reading in a sister's video, and she's very oh um she's so much filled with so much knowledge of this. It's just wow, like. Wow, I'm amazed. And so I've, I've been, the Lord has kept leading me back to Esther. And I, I have seen this, I can't tell you how many times within this year I have been led to Esther 2, 16. Esther was taken to the king um, at the, the royal palace in the tenth month of the seventh year of his reign. Well, you guys, we have, um, in January 20th, is was the beginning of the true tenth month. And also, January 20th was also the, be the seventh year of President Obama's reign in the office. So... I'm not saying this is, but it's something to, to keep a watch for. And, 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 and if God is pressing on your heart to share something, you know, and even if, you know, even, even if you want more confirmation, if he's already telling you to share it, share it. Because that day is coming to where we're not going to be here to share that and people are going to be looking for him. They're going to be looking for hope. They're they're going to be they're going to be on a hunt, wanting to know what happened and is this all true. And we, as you know, as servants for God, we need to be obedient and show people that this is true. The Bible is true. It is real. And then. So after um, I, I was led to Esther, when Esther becomes queen and is led to, is taken to the king during the tenth month of the seventh, uh, the, ki the king's seventh year, I, I, pr I was like, okay, okay, God, you know, just give me a reassurance and uh, show me another scripture as a reassurance and. Ah! <laughs> I'm so excited. Uh, he led me to 1 Corinthians 15, um, 
he led me well he he led me to fifteen thirty five which is which is the the resurrection of the body and as I continued um to read it 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 was <laughs> whew, oh lord fires are raining on me i am yes thank you jesus thank you jesus um uh fifteen fifty so it says, What I am saying, dear brothers and sisters, is that our physical bodies cannot inherit the kingdom of God. These dying bodies cannot enter what will last forever. But let me reveal to you a wonderful secret. We will not all die, but we will all be transformed. <laughs> it will happen in a moment. In the blink of an eye, when the last trumpet is blown, for when the trumpet sounds, who have died will be raised to live forever, and we who are living will also be transformed. For our dying bodies must be transformed into bodies that will never die. Our mortal bodies must be transformed into immortal bodies. And then, uh, so amazing, because I don't know how I even had this slipped me by um but I'll make another video on that he revealed something to me uh from one of my dreams and I was like wow thank you thank you Jesus so uh I just wanted to share that word with you you guys so keep your heads up stay in prayer God bless you and I love you all bye